you were traveling. Yeah, I was. I was. I was actually. I, I was traveling to Prague, and then I went in uh, Dresden to play. Yeah, the concerts. Yeah, for for concerts, and then I went in Berlin and in other places in Germany. And, yeah. Um, and there it was a, a bit shocking we had like zero precautions <laughs> they didn't mind at all and um, yeah. so when I came back I said okay let's, let's try to be isolated for a couple of weeks yeah so yeah okay. but, but I'm back mm -hmm. but, but okay yeah okay cool cool yeah. so now yeah. how, how is it going there <laughs> I heard that they close the flights and this kind of stuff, but it's... Yeah, well, I mean, I mean, the, the, I mean, there's nobody dead from it, you know, and there are only like 200 cases or something. So it's really, I mean, it's nothing happening, really. Uh, and, uh, and uh, but, but the, everybody's panicking, you know, and, and, they, and the government just sh shut down everything and all stores, everything's shutting down and they're locking everything down, no schools, no nothing. And... So there, everybody's basically panicking and going into kind of this panic. So it's kind of funny, but whatever. We'll, we'll have to just <laughs> we'll have to wait. I mean, I, I guess it's I guess it's a good idea to to do that for a couple of weeks, you know, just to be safe or whatever. I think it is many days, you know. It doesn't affect me anyways, because I, I I don't care. I stay home all all the time anyways. I stay home. Well, Actually, this is what I do in my free time. I stay home and I play music and I yeah. kind of stuff. And of course, I had like a quite serious uh, economical impact after this because of the concerts of the next two months that cancelled. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All concerts next two months cancelled. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, and I I'm a bit worried that uh, this will affect even the summer and. Uh, yeah. Because it, it could be a bit longer than what they are telling us. Yeah. I, I, I would be surprised if everything gets back to normality in one month, like they are saying. I mean, it means that it could. It can I, take. I, I, I would not put this virus anymore, actually, as a real thing. It's, if it really shuts up in one month, it's, that would be surprising. It can be a little more than that, yeah, yeah, yeah. But, you know, I mean, it, it won't last forever, right? You know? No. So. But yeah, I think uh, this is a problem for 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 concerts for sure. Yeah, that's the first thing that gets hit. So it's a good time. To, so it's a good time to yeah. to study, <laughs> make use of the time. Yeah. Okay, so let's get started. Um, yeah. Um, so basically, uh, obviously, what we're gonna do is talk about. North Indian music, right? Yeah. Because we have Indian music, you have South is Carnatic, you know this, and the North is Hindustani, right? So, um, so the, it's quite, the, the, those, two, those two kinds of music are quite, quite similar, you know, of course they have ragas and they have saragama paranisa and all this kind of stuff, they have talas, but they're different. They're quite different, like, like, the, like the South has um, a lot more um, long compositions. And, they, and what's particular in the South is they have these gamakas. They have like many, many, many types of gamakas. Uh, 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 this kind of, a lot of very complicated gamakas. And um, in the North, it's, it's, it's quite... It's more simple, actually. In, in the north, you ha you you only really have four types of 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 ways to play a note. Only four types, yeah. and you don't have long compositions. And the melodic um, rules, like in the south, you can have like scales, any kind of. They have all these the, the hundreds of scales, right? Seventy-two, actually. But in the north, you have a lot of restrictions on what notes you can have like like you wouldn't have like a a sharp 4 and a flat 7 in the same in the same scale they wouldn't allow that because it would be so they have the north is 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 a more sim, sim, simplified system so one thing 
in the north, the so 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 we're just going to talk about North Indian music. Mm-hmm. So um, there are only four ways to play a note. Mm-hmm. Everything that you hear in Indian. I'm just going to say Indian music. When I say Indian music, I'm talking about North Indian music. Okay, right. So, eh, only four ways to play a note. Every single thing you hear, mm-hmm. there, every note that you ever hear will be played in only one of four ways. Okay? okay. Now, the first way, they're called varnas. Varnas. Var- varnas. The favorite. Sure, sure. Varanas. No, uh, var, var, na. Mm-hmm. Varanas. Varanas. Okay. Okay. Now, the first varna, the first varna, of course, is uh, siddha. It's straight. It's just da, sa, right? Straight. Sa, re, ga, ma, pa, da, ni, sa. Right? So straight. The second varna is from below. Sa, sa. Right. Mm-hmm. The third varna is from above. So, 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 this kind of thing, and the and the fourth varna is around, circular. Mm-hmm. So da da na na. Huh? Starting from up, always, so down. No, uh, no, no. Uh, good question. I mean, usually just da, 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 da. Yeah, yeah, down. You could be, you, you could go from down also. Da, da. From down yeah. also. Yeah, yeah, I guess. Sure. Da, 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 da. Yeah, from down also. Circular. Mm-hmm. And um, what about, and you, do you, you know how the notes work? Like with Sarega. Sarega, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, and you know that. They're the Komal notes and the Tivrama, right? Okay, and you know how to notate this, these, these things? I, I never really understood because I found, I found different ways. Okay. Different books to write this. Yeah. Okay, so, so the, way, um, the way we're going to do it is um, for the Komal notes, you just put an underline. Okay, okay. All right? Okay. So this is like the Komal. Uh, can't really see it. Hold it a little further away. Oh, further away, further away. Not so close to the camera. I, I can't really see that, it's so blurry. But it's got... Uh, okay. I, I agree with a line. Yeah, under. Okay. Yeah, so underline. Yeah. And um, so, and uh, ma, so there's only one Tivra note, is ma, and you write ma with a line, a straight line on top. Okay. Should I type? No. Should I type that for you? No, no. I think I think it's. I think it's a so underline and six signs. Okay. Yeah, yeah. And um, then you have the main octave. Okay, the main octave. And then the high sa yeah. will have a dot. Yeah. On the top. Okay. <clears throat> the high sa will have a dot, and then. Then all those will have a have a okay. dot, and then the, the very third octave you'll have two dots yeah, for okay. sa. Okay, and mm-hmm. and so <clears throat> so the main octave is a sa re ga ma So you have sa ni. As soon as you go down ni, that ni will have a dot under. Okay. Okay. Sa ni da ba ma ga ri sa. Two octaves down, two dots, but usually. Two octaves, three octaves is about the max for what you're going to do. Okay, so um, so if you know all of that, um, yeah, I mean, before we actually play, maybe it's good to just uh, just to describe 
a lot of the basics of the of the music basically so so basically um you'll you'll start um the way uh, a concert performance will work basically is you is you will start with uh, alap right alap alap george ala you know this Yes, um, so the most fundamental way is alap torchala, right? And then you'll have a vilambit gut. Vilambit. Yeah. Vilambit yeah. means yeah. slow. Slow what? Yeah, the slow one. Slow gut. And then yeah. uh, madhyalaya gut. Yeah. Madhyalaya is medium yeah. speed. Yeah. Drut gut. And then chala. Yeah. Chala, right. Um, so usually, usually you'll start with... Um, <clears throat> you'll start with what's called a big, a big raga. Mm -hmm. Okay, a big raga is a raga that has a lot of melodic possibilities. Mm -hmm. Okay, so like Yaman, yes. Malkons, you know, Bagashi. Okay, these are called these are called big ragas because you can really you can really develop them a lot with improvisation okay so you can play them for a long time now that's usually what you'll start with is a big raga and of course you know about the timings you, you have to play in the correct time yeah. right you have morning ragas afternoon you know this um, so you start with the big raga and then after you will play that big raga then the next piece you will play will probably be a small raga. A small raga. Okay, and what a small raga is, is basically a more of a um, phrase orientated ragas. Mm -hmm. Okay, Do you, have you heard that term before, phrase orientated? Mm, not really, but I think I, I, I get what you mean. Yeah, okay, okay. Yeah, because some ragas are pretty open like i said yaman you have a ar arro avro do you know these terms yeah. right yeah. so you have the ascending yeah. order descending order and you have the vadi samvadi yeah the important notes important notes right um so with the big ragas you have not you have some i mean all ragas have phrases characteristic phrases but some some ragas are are only you only have a few phrases and and you can't really do much except those phrases so okay. they're me they're they're called a small raga because you you don't have so many possibilities so that's not a raga that, that you want to play for another half 45 minutes right you, that would be more so the first piece you give the big raga the second piece you'll play in a small raga and maybe maybe you, you, you can use a, a different tala other than tintal. You know the talas, right? Yeah. Tintal? You've heard of tintal? Sorry? Yeah, that's uh, that'll be Madhyalaya. That's Madhyalaya. Dru uh Vilambit Tintal is da right, right. Drut is da din din da da din din da din din da okay, okay. So then you have all other talas. Do, do you know the other talas? Yeah, no, Rubak, um, Etal, Jatal, uh, Jatal Pizavari. Yeah, 11 yeah. beats, good, good, yeah. And, uh, what is it? Matatal, Matatal. And, um, Chandi. I, I don't remember the take out. Matatal? Da terkidin na tun na da 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 terkidin nine beats yeah and uh, ch um, deep chandi is very nice uh, yeah yeah deep chandi and um, you have kehrava which are a bit different like mogoli well kehrava of course no yeah. Okay. What was the other one you said? I never heard of that. Mongoli is a seven beat. It's an Afghani. Oh, really? I never heard about that. Uh, that's probably for Rabab a lot. Yeah. Yeah. yeah cool, cool. I don't know that one. Um, okay. So, so 
then you will you have the small raga and then after that you will probably play a tumuri. Oh, yeah. Okay, oh, so folk composition. Well not necessarily folk, no no. Folk yeah. though folk would be a dhun. Ah, okay. So 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 first you yeah. First you will do um tumuri is not considered folk music. That's considered okay. to be light classical. Okay. Okay. And um, are you familiar with how, how 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 the melodic stuff works with tumuri? Sorry. Are you familiar with how the how how the melodic the melody is approached compared no. to no? Okay. So so this is. This is uh, something we we can talk about. Is is the difference about how do you approach the improvisation between you know between kial kial is the main uh, that's what you right kial and tumuri. Okay, that's the. Sorry. Yeah, and then and then dhun after that dhun. So dhun dhun is not considered really classical music, but. You know, this is the way, the direction the concert goes. So, so you first you play big raga, and then you will play small raga, and then you will play a tumri, and then you will play maybe, if they still want more, then you play bhairavi. Yeah, right. Always the last piece should be bhairavi. And then if the public is demanding more and more, then, then, and then you will play a dhun. A folk, okay. folk, and then if they are completely demanding more and more, then you play Bollywood. Okay. That's a joke. <laughs> not just kidding. Um, so, yeah. Okay. So, so this is the shape of the concert. And um, mm -hmm. about the alap, do you, do you understand how to play alap? Sorry. Do you understand how to play alap? Well, I mean, I, I understand what it is. Yeah. Um, but do you understand the, the 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 system of developing? No, this is something that I that, well, I heard about, but I never I never. Okay, so so that's a good place to start then. That's a good place yeah. to start. So so what we can do is we can choose one raga, mm -hmm. and then we can and then we can uh, I can show you how to uh, develop the alap. Yeah. So, uh, which raga do you want to start with? Well, one, one that's easy to start with. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, do, 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 um, do you have an instrument there or, or not? Um, well, I have my four string robot there, which yeah. I have the taru, or as you said, we can start with voice. We can also start with the voice, yeah, yeah. Well, um, uh, what, what key are the instruments in? Do you have anything in C? In C? Yeah. Uh, or, or it doesn't have three. to be. Okay, I have, I have this one in C sharp, and I have the taru in D. Okay, C sharp something? That would be cool. Yeah, C sharp and the robab in C sharp. Okay, so let, let, let's, let's use the robab then, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Oh, no, then I will I will set up the, your instrument actually. I can imagine it's a bit limiting because of the breaks and stuff. Uh, I'll tune it quickly. Sorry? Let me tune it quickly. Yeah. That's in D though, right? D? Well, C sharp. C sharp. Uh, no, no, no. This one is in D. The other one is in C sharp. Yeah. Mm -hmm. the... oh. You are tuning to D sharp. Oh, I can tune to C sharp if you want, or C. C sharp is okay. Okay. 
Let's do. We can do Bin Binashraj. You remember that one? Um, I, I remember you playing in the video, but I can't. Yeah, I, I want to do that because um, I can't tune this string up to pa, so I tune down, so I tune to ma, and and we can have a sa ma raga. Oh, and we, or we can also do um, raga shri or baga shri. These are all sa ma ragas. But we can start with well, a, bin a Sharaj is good because it's easy. Yeah, let me let me say let me the other one easy. Then I have an excellent. I cannot do below the moon with the other rumba, but I'll put it one in C sharp too. Can you tune to C sharp? Okay. Shoot, yeah, yeah. Ma. So we could play, um, just to start, we could play the, just the scale, like... different okay mm. it's a t completely different approach but kial yeah. alap is a systematic development where mm. you okay it depends it changes from raga to raga 
but the basic idea is you develop the first note, then you develop the next note, and then the next note, <laughs> and you just keep developing. Mm -hmm. so, so basically you develop Sa, you develop Re, you develop Ga, etc, etc, etc. But, but, in practice, mm -hmm. it's a little different. So, so what, what you do is, first, we will develop Sa, okay? Mm -hmm. Now, what very good to keep, to keep in your mind is, is, is that if you're developing Sa, it doesn't necessarily mean that you play Sa, okay? Yeah. It means that you have, Sa is, is the focal point in your mind, but you play notes below it, you play notes above it, you play around it, but you keep Sa like your center of gravity, mm -hmm. right? Yes. You keep Sa like, like the center of gravity. So, I'll give you an example, okay? I'll play for you an example. So, here is Sa, right? Okay? So the beginning of a lap, there are many ways you can do it. If you want to be very simple, you can just go. So you play the chicory a few times. Okay? I can play a lot of knee, but still I'm, I'm developing Sa. Still so Sa. You're creating like a long cadence on the Sa, no? Exactly, exactly. And you release it there. Yeah, exactly. And, and then you still, like, you, you have a whole section where you're developing sa, but with each extra phrase, you're kind of moving slightly further away from the sa. So, so as you saw in the beginning, I just, I just played sa. But in the next phrases, I was playing more knees, right? Now in the next phrases, I might play more like, more dha. So you will keep doing this, more and more phrases, until you finish Sa, and then you will conclude by playing something like, like... No, it normally will be like, Ni, Ni, Re, Sa, Sa, Chi, Chi, Sa, Chi, Chi, Ni, Ni, Re, Sa. But this Raga, you have no Re. So we have mm. to go ni ni ga sa, right? Okay. So you conclude each section with uh, some like more rhythmical phrase. This is what well, well, it's not really a rhythmical phrase. It's more like just really like that. Da, chi, da, chi, chi, da, chi. You don't have to do it, but this is a very. You don't have to do that. But this okay. is a very um, typical way to punctuate. Mm -hmm. That's a period at the end of the, the paragraph or, or whatever, you know. Mm -hmm. You can do it even this short, you can just listen. Something very short, it's up to you, you're the artist. But if you listen to a lot of uh, sitar or sarod concerts, Listen to their lap, you, you'll hear them. At the end of their paragraphs, they'll do this. Ah, chi, chi, sa, chi, chi, sa, chi, chi. Yeah. You go back to sa, regardless of where you, where you were. Yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah. So, for example, so, so then the next...
I mean, you can think of it as like uh, in this raga, you will develop. Next, you will you will go down. Mm -hmm. You won't go up. The next development is is the next note down, which means knee. So then you develop knee. Okay. For a while, and then, and then, ta. And then your next big stopping point will be ma. Not below. Yes. So you be like, like, like. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Just really drag, very, like, don't rush anything. And that will be, because the idea is you really develop this really relaxed yeah. vibe. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. So then, after you go all the way down to the low sa, then you will make a phrase and finish on the middle sa again. slowly to ma.
then eventually, eventually, you have to kind of tease, like tease, like hinting at sa. But don't just go. Don't just do that. You spoil everything. So you have to, you have to just, you know, the same with makam. You know, like you tease and, and you don't hit it and you go this way and that way, above it, below it, you know. Sa, so, finally. Mm -hmm. So then you hit sa. Yeah. So basically, I mean, I think you get the idea, right? You develop, yeah, yeah. yeah you develop up the scale, basically, each each okay. note. It's different for, for, for different ragas and some, like this is a five note raga, so each note is important, pretty yeah. much. But some ragas you have, um, some notes are not so important. So you don't, mm -hmm. you don't play them too much and you don't like develop, you know, if it's, if it's a very unimportant note, you don't like develop it. It's just used, you know, but that depends, raga to raga, it's, it's different. You have to learn, you actually have to learn each raga a little bit individually. Yeah. But, but the basic idea is this development. Now, after that, so after you develop the sa, all the way up, then, then you, you come back. Back down to middle sa. Okay? Mm -hmm. Then at the end you do that like. Yeah, yeah, and then you do the, you just add this rhythm, and then what you do is you do the same thing again with the development, same as alap, but you have this development, okay? So then you do sa. Blah 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 blah. You understand? And then, yeah, understand. and then when you finish, when you finish the jaw, all the way up to high sa, and then you come back down again, and, and you have the, the rhythm, the fast rhythm, and again you do the same as alap, sa sa, and you develop. So that's mm -hmm. that's the basic uh, technique for developing um, alap jaw chala. Okay. okay. Now. After that, you, you're going to play a, a Willembit gut. Yes. Right? Okay. So, how do you develop that? Also the same way. You, you, you have your gut and your composition. You play the composition. And after you finish the composition, then again, you play the same. You play a lot. Developing sa, but... Mm -hmm. In, in, when you finish the paragraph, instead of going sa chi chi sa chi chi, instead of finish doing like this, you 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 come back into the composition again. Yeah. Right. Okay. So that's a little bit. That part is a little bit tricky. I, I think you know how to do this already. You know, with with, with the tabla player, where you have the tala, yeah. and you yeah. you practice you practice how to make your improvisation flow back into. Yeah. The composite, the, the, the gut. It's something I never practiced. So you never. Pra able to. <laughs> okay, so so that's 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 kind but of. I mean, with the sounds and then the little the eyes, and then you end up on the on the how do you call it? Uh, some, some. Well, no, not the some, like the phrase that. Uh, mukra. No. The mukra. The mukra. Yeah, yeah. Well, I mean. There are many, many ways to, yeah, there are many ways. I mean, you can actually, and it depends where you are in the raga. And, and like in the beginning, you, um, yeah, I mean, you're talking about the, the villain, but gut, 
right? Yeah. Then um, usually you 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 will uh, you 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 will you will finish your improvisation and come back into the mukra, which is the um, the twelfth beat. Yeah. The twelfth beat, right? Yes. Usually. In tintal. In tintal. Yeah, yeah. So. And. Uh, and so, is that something you 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 are doing? You you have done very much. Well, I've done when I was studying this thing with Zani, uh, but okay. Uh, I got lost. Okay, so why don't we um, why don't we just for a couple of minutes, mm -hmm. just a couple of minutes, we can play a little bit of a lap together. Yeah, sure. And then and then we can touch on, we can start one uh, Willem Gut. Yeah. Okay? And then, yeah. uh, and that can be, that can be enough to get you started. A little bit of a lap and a little bit of Willem Yeah. Okay. I think that's right, the tuning. The only thing is that uh, my lowest note on this instrument is the low mark. Okay, that's okay. Yep. That's okay. So tell you what, I, I I'll play uh, I'll play a phrase, and then you uh, copy. Yeah. Okay. Let me find a way to record. Oh, I I'm recording. I'm ah, you are recording. I'm recording okay. everything. Okay. Yeah. So I can just put it on YouTube afterwards. Mm -hmm. If you want to record also, it's no problem. Okay. Okay. So I'll just play a very short phrase and then you'll copy it, okay? So. Careful, listen carefully. Ah. Yes, very good. Very good, very good. Very good. 
Yeah, you don't really play here. Oh, you can't go up there. Okay, okay, that's all right. So let's uh, let's do. Um, how about this? Nisa. That's it, good. Yeah, I should really put my... I should put my... Uh, so, yes, I'll be back in two seconds. Practice, practice. Putting these uh, things on my fingers, uh -huh. these little um, glue things, because uh, otherwise I'm not getting any sound, you know. Let's see. Nice. Go for go from the uh, like ga ma ga ma ga na uh, like that varna remember that varna is uh, yeah, this, that varna is like that you're playing you want to play ga from above like ga 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 like ma ga ma ga yeah yes yeah yes try again try again. But even the first Nisa every time. Yeah, yes. It's like uh, Turkish music, like every note you want to try to decorate every note if possible, yeah. Nisa ma like gama nisa gama. Yeah. No, do it with one finger. Maga, maga, maga. Yeah, but you have frets, though, right? Those are. You have frets? You have frets, right? Yeah, I have frets. Yeah, that's it. Okay. It'll be good to get the, yeah, get the rabud, rabud, rabud going. Yeah, yeah. I, I'll, I'll put it in, though. Oh, can you? Can you put it in though? That's yeah, good. just a bit. I, I think I can if I can do these things. Okay, next time. So I have these things and get a better sound. Much better sound, eh? Like, like really, um, like very wide vibratos, you know, like, 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 sa, sa, ga, like a, yeah, like a, like, sa, sa, ga, sa, try to 
just like so good. That's it, yes. Good, good, good. And This here because I can't. This is, the camera is sitting exactly where your hand is going to be. Good. Maybe I'll put this a little bit closer here, maybe. Try all with one finger. Okay, we'll try it a little easier. So just try this for now. Each note is played with that varna from above. Yeah, yeah, but it's very like it's. To do it from the ga, no? No, 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 no. Like, look, watch, watch. Okay, the ga is like. Okay, and the sa. I'm just like uh, you, just a little bit. It's just a little bit above. I mean. You you can, but it's too too much. You see, like it's just yeah. like a. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. You have to practice that. Yeah, yeah. I'm afraid it's a bit difficult because you. It's difficult. The... Yeah. No. Yeah, it'll be better when you. Have... That's good. That's good. Okay. No, try it. Very good. 
very good. That's good. That's good. Now. Especially not in the raga. It's not in the raga, but you could. It's okay to play it. Very, very fast. Yeah. Or or shoot a knee. You can like a few in. Or common knee also. If you play really slowly. It's, that's not okay. Not slowly, but but. Yeah. Really fast. You have, I think you can take your alap quite well. And now let's look at the the a composition, okay? Let's take a okay. maybe we have a Vilambit. Let me look on my files here. A Vilambit Binisharaj. Binisharaj. Let's see here if we have a a composition. <coughs> What's that? No, that's why I'm not a physical item. Okay. Do you still have those? Oh, I can also send it to you. Yeah, yeah, I have those. I, is there? Well, let's see. Yeah, I, I'm going to look now and find if I can find something good. I have a, a Rupak Tintal. Rupak might be nice. A Willembit. Japtal, Lombitintal, what is this? Madhyalaya Tintal, this is not really a big raga. Japtal, Lombitintal, here we go, yes. 
Here we go. So uh, let me play this. Can you hear that? Mm -hmm. um, yep. Do you, should I send you the, the paper or, or do you want to just write yeah. that? Do you want... if, if you have it, if it's easy for you to send it, you just send it to me. Should I just send it to you? Through, uh, okay, so I'll send it on the Facebook? The chat. Yeah. Is that possible? Let's see here, Vinish Raj 6, okay. I think on the, on the chat, no? Yeah. Let's see if that's possible to do that um, while the Oh yeah. Oh yes. Okay. Yes, I can. Okay, I'll do that right now. Mm -hmm. Come on. Go. Okay. Old folders. Where the hell? Here we go. Okay, it's going, should be going. Yes. Sorry? It didn't arrive yet. There it is. Ah, okay. Yeah. You got it? Okay, it's right at the top. Okay. Okay. Can you play for me? Okay, should I play it or sing it? Oh, sing it. We can sing it. I can maybe sing it. So. <laughs> Okay, ni sa ga ma ga ni, sorry, ni sa ga ma ga sa ni da ni sa ga ga, let me get that right, ni sa ga ma ga sa ni da ni sa ga ga ma 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 ga ma da That's some is ma ma. Sorry? It's in the page. It's in the page you sent me now. Yeah, it should be. Can you find it? Let's see here. It should be right there. Yeah, yeah. Or maybe not. Hang on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's right at the top. It's right at the top. It's called um. It's the very first line. It's called Willem Bit Tintal Ed's Composition. Okay? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Now, you see... Okay. You see how, like, over, over at the very uh, top right-hand corner, it says, Nisa Gama? Okay. 
Nisagama Nisagama Gasanida Nisagagama Yeah? Can you see that? Yes, yes. Okay, found it. Yeah? Okay. Mm -hmm. it, it's kind of confusing though, right? The way it's written? Is it, or is that... Uh, Nisagama So... That's all one beat. So one beat is, the villain beat is like one, two, yeah. right? So when you have one beat, it's Nisa Gama. Yes. Okay? And the next beat is Ga. That's a full beat, right? Yeah, yeah. Yes. Ga. No, 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 no. Yeah. In Sa Ni Da Nisa Ga Ga Ma. Gama da sa ni sa ni da gama. 